All right, guys, so I want to show you a sexy little pixel peek that I've used multiple times before this. A lot of people ask me, hey, Rec, why do you open this door that's next to West Buildings 301 in the resort? Why do you do that? Why do you open these rooms? Well, guys, to be honest, the reason I open these rooms is because I don't like to be stuck in one side of the building. I want to be able to, I mean, we are stuck technically in one side of the building, but I want to be able to frag and then maneuver from left to right. I don't want to stay in one area. And in this area also, there's a pixel peak. And this pixel peak is dangerous. If players don't understand this pixel peak, you will slap them hard, all right? And what I mean by that is, is that what you're gonna see me do to these two players is just disgusting. They have probably no idea where I shot them from, and they probably thought I was cheating. But I'm here to show you how to embarrass geared boys like these in your, you know, some near future. I'm not advertising this spot as a spot for you to camp to kill people. I'm advertising this spot because as a solo player, when I hear people coming up to fight me, this is a specific area that I can easily defend myself. And if people want to keep pushing, they normally die. Uh, nine out of 10 times, I win these fights in this area because I know this stuff because map knowledge is everything in this game all right see you guys in raid has to be right it has to be boss guy in the mid over by admin here's what we do we throw an aid push them around So the boss cabs are coming in. They're gonna push whoever's in here. So before you move in, you wanna make sure that they're all settled in and they're not still moving around, right? You fail on this nade, but the whole purpose of throwing nades is to push these scabs, especially the boss ones, into a compromisable position. These flashlights as well are going to blind them. It's going to keep them from shooting you accurately. Granata, dude! That's, that's a grenade launcher. That's a grenade launcher. See? So the reason we say see there is we saw a person cross through the shadows. We saw their silhouette. So we're going to hold this area for that a second. That was a grenade launcher. And then we're going to push up and prepare for an ambush.
All right, we'll wait for these guys to run across. What's up, Mig? How you doing, buddy? A few moments later. That's definitely a boss scav. That's the one we shot at originally, right? All right, all right, all right. No big deal, no big deal. Running across is never a good idea, especially on the sky bridge. I can show you multiple videos of me doing the same thing with tons of different people. Oh, he's coming to us. There it is. Oh yeah. See on your left in here. Twenty rounds. Okay, that's fine. The nade came from across the way. We could check for red key card, I just don't care. So we're not gonna go downstairs and check. No reason to. That's scary, right? Does that mean someone probably shot from here to kill somebody else? Or the boss scouts killed someone up there? We can't see any anything in those windows. That's even scarier. So the West 303 room is one of the rooms I always open when I come up here. It allows me to have the option to bound across or jump into a room that an opponent will not predict that I could be in. That is huge for setting up for this pixel peak you're about to see. Yeah, so like what MIG's telling you is that you can put different optics on, but in the current state of the game, the only optics in my opinion that are worth using on most guns are the PK-06, right? Some of the ranged op optics aren't bad. Bruh. I wish I could see in some of these windows, man. Okay, now we can. I, I know that there is no way. There's no way that that was not a grenade launcher we heard earlier, right? So we actually ended up killing that boss scav. Uh, but we hear some footsteps outside. We hear them in front and behind us. So we thought originally we didn't kill him. We didn't kill that boss guy, by the way. But we do know someone's outside. Sound cues are everything. I heard movement outside. That's why you saw me duck. Here they come. There's two.
Three. That is map knowledge, by the way. Pixel Peaks. Amazing. All right. We're going to pop a painkiller. We're going to clear. And then we're going to uh, hope there's not a third. Six armor. Easy money. Perfect. Okay, yeah, we did. He's right there. Hmm. Bar bar. Someone else grabbed it. That's okay. This is stupid. What you guys see me doing right here? I should have already moved. We should have been out of the open by now. Um, our body obviously got hit. We shot him in the face a few times. Takes some extreme luck to hit us in a leg or something to slow us down. Oh, yeah. There we go, bros. That was easy. 18 ducking K raid, bros. Holy frick.